we do have a brand new article to go through. This new rule could squeeze short sellers. Let's check this out. The SEC proposed a new rule that would further circle in on short sellers. The rule proposed that some investors would be required to report their short sale activity to the SEC each month. And in doing so, the SEC would have detailed short selling information readily available to provide to the public. So more transparency. Well, retail investors express frustration that there are more shares being shorted than that are readily available to short. There is currently minimal public data that is accessible for retail investors to confirm or deny this. The proposed rule 13F-2 under the Securities and Exchange Act of 1934 would require institutional investment managers that hold a short position of at least 10 million or the equivalent of 2.5% or more of the total shares outstanding in an individual security. It's refreshing to see that Gary Gensler and the SEC are continuing to make their mission to increase transparency of short sellers for the investing public. Gensler states that finance is ultimately about trust and the official sector has made instilled the trust through a set of rules and disclosure, anti-fraud and anti-manipulation. The bigger question is going to be, will Gary Gensler push these rules past and will there finally be more transparency for the retail investors moving forward? But if you want to stay up to date with everything else that's going on with AMC, because trust me, there's a lot more to go through, make sure to please subscribe to my channel with notifications turned on so you never miss out on a video. Also, drop a like on this video for some good luck moving forward for AMC. And lastly, go to the second link down below in my description and join my private exclusive Discord server. Thanks as always, guys, and I'll see you in the next one.